Good morning, Shoe Family. Welcome to Thursday, June 3rd. It is a blue day today, and we're going to get started with our pledge, Moment of Silence, and the Roar Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silent reflection. And now for our Roar Pledge. I pledge to respect school policies, rules, staff members, and students. I pledge to show outstanding effort in school. I pledge to attend school daily and on time, and I pledge to be responsible in all school settings. Remember, we are Tigers, and we roar to achieve. All right, let's get started with those morning announcements. All right, for June 3rd, which is a blue day, our quote for today is, all things are difficult before they are easy. Yes, everything's a little hard when you first try it. As you do it over and over again and practice and put effort into it, it gets easier and easier. And your brain grows while you're doing that, by the way. All right, so as we are in this June 3rd day, this is the official last day of the fourth marking period. It's time to make sure everything is tied up, done, and put in your best effort, hopefully, for this marking period to get the best grade possible. <clears throat> All right, we have some celebrations to talk about today, and those are our students of the month. As you know, uh, we've been celebrating students each month. Each grade level team can only pick one student to celebrate, so it's a pretty big deal. So we're going to uh, celebrate one student from each grade level for the month of May. Right, the first student we're going to celebrate is our sixth grader, Susie salazar Alberin. Susie's teachers say she's the ultimate example of Roar. She started the year with internet troubles and also English being her second language, had to learn a whole new language. She is finishing the year coming to school every day, working hard, asking questions, participating, understanding standing and her English has gotten so much better and she is all around polite helpful friendly young lady way to go Susie you have grit and then in seventh grade we're going to celebrate Abigail Forche Abigail's teachers say Abby is willing to participate in class discussions has a positive attitude takes responsibility for class assignments and is a pleasure to have in class Abby is always someone we they can count on for working hard although the material does not always come easy she pushes through asks questions and makes sure she is able to do what we learn what we are doing abby is abby is a great student all around and your seventh grade teachers abby are going to miss you next year when you go on to eighth grade all right for a speaking of eighth grade we have an eighth grader to celebrate brianna felix brianna's teachers say she has been on top of her work all year, participates daily in the Zoom chat and verbally, always makes meaningful contributions to class, is positive and happy. Um, they, uh, You're amazing on Zoom and always shows excellent work ethic and always displays Roar expectations. So great job, Brianna. And we want to celebrate Susie, Abigail, and Brianna, our students of the month for May. Great job, ladies. And Dr. James also has some students that she would like to celebrate for huge growth in iReady. And they are Naeem Judu, Janice Franklin, Jexnir Pandoha Alicia, Logan Tyre, Cheyenne Sisko, Ty Tyler Neal, Adriana Thompson Baez, Jalen Earl, Maylet Martinez Cruz, and Max Stanley. Great job to all of you for huge success on iReady. And Ms. Loudermilch would like to shout out to Logan Brown, Raggy Heichel, Lamaya, Marion, and Vance Nobles for putting forth outstanding effort to stay on task in enrichment this marking period. And also give a shout out to her first and second block students for doing a wonderful job on their passion project presentations and teaching her so much. I would love to see those presentations, Miss Loudermilch. And also she's celebrating Marlon Gruz Garcia for cheering on his classmates and adding so much positivity to the class. So great job, and I can't wait to hear more about those projects. All right, birthdays, here we come. All right, for our birthdays today, we're gonna say a very happy birthday on June 3rd to Layla Seed, Jeremiah McAllister, Sarah Padbury, and Logan Tyre, as well as Aaron Wren. Happy birthday on June 3rd. And because you guys have off on June 4th while the teachers do their grading, a very happy birthday on June 4th to Giovanni Mercado Garcia, to Leila Ojifitimi, uh, to Je Jessica Perry, 
Christina Warnock, and Remus Yusuf, along with our staff member, Mr. Wesley. Happy birthday to you as well. And then on June 5th, Saturday, a very happy birthday to Manuel Lara, to Brooke Litton, and Chase O'Neill. And then on Sunday, a very happy birthday to Carly Misano, as well as Miss Arter and Miss Harrison Dixon. So we've got a lot of birthdays to celebrate over this weekend. We hope that everybody has a great weekend and have an awesome Thursday.